When Jamie Bichelia met up with some fishermen who'd hooked an octopus during a fishing derby August 2nd, she saw an opportunity for an unusual picture. It was a photo contest in, in the derby. And so crazy me, hindsight now, and looking back, I probably made a big mistake. Michelle, put the small octopus on her face and posed. It grabbed her face with its suckers, then did something she didn't expect. It bit her on the face. It had barreled its, its beak into my chin and then let go a little bit and did it again. It was a really intense pain when it when it went inside and uh, it just bled uh, dripping blood for a long time I had Michelle you says the octopus was a smaller version of this giant Pacific octopus that lives in the Point Defiance Aquarium an aquarium spokeswoman says it could also be a Pacific red octopus both have a powerful beak used to break and eat crabs clams and mussels and their bite contains a poisonous venom to immobilize their prey Michelia says that venom left her in incredible pain. But as owner of South Sound Salmon Sisters, she kept fishing for two more days before she finally went to the emergency room. And I'm still in pain. Um, I'm on three different antibiotics. Um, this can come and go, the swelling for months, they say. And Michelia says the whole painful experience taught her a valuable lesson about handling a live octopus. This was not a good idea. Hindsight, looking back, um, I will never do it again.